time yet? Oh, 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 ow, ooh, ow, another flip. Oh, come on, let's go again. Next, it was the monkey's turn. He whacked Poe all over with his chubby body with the bamboo crane. Bit, bit, bam, 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 bam. And Crane sent Poe falling flat on his face, and he sailed in the air and flew. Oh, plop, splat, splat. Oh, I've been taking it easy on you, Pandy said. You, you think your opponent will be gentle on you? Mm, your next opponent could be me. He grabbed Poe with a kung fu hold, said the Crane. The path to victory is to use your opponent's strength against him. Aha, until he fails or quits, he said. Poe was inspired. Don't worry, master, I'll never quit. Oh, oh, ow, ow, ow. Can you just lay off a little bit, Crane? Oh, oh, monkey, Crane, come on, Viper. Watch your little snarling, snarling sisses over there. Oh, can we take a break yet? I'm hungry. I want a soda pop and cookies. Come on, where's the snack tray? I need a break. Mmm, yeah, I'm kind of hungry too. Pink, the uh, Kung Fu Panda has a point. But time was running out for Poe to master Kung Fu. The bad news was Tai Long's escape reached the palace. Shifu rushed to tell Ogwe. This is bad news, Ogwe said. If you do not believe that the dragon warrior can stop him. Master, that panda is not the dragon warrior, Shifu said. You need to believe me, Shifu. Ogwe told him. And you must continue your journey without me. He handed his staff to Shifu, then he packed away and disappeared forever in a swirl of petals. This panda is not a warrior. You should see him. He's just a big guy with a big stomach, and and he just wants to eat all the time. Well, back at the bunkhouse, Poe was making fun of the Furious Five by imitating Shifu, and Shifu made himself suddenly walk in. Tai Lung is coming, he told Poe sternly. You are the only one can stop him. What? Me? He laughed nervously, and here I thought you had no sense of humor. I'm going to stop Tai Lung. How can I do that? But then he realized Shifu was serious, and as soon as the master turned to speak to the five, Poe spun on his heel and ran away as fast as he could. Shifu soon caught up with Poe as message was cleared. I can train you, Shifu said. I will turn you into a dragon warrior. Well, how can I be a dragon warrior? I mean, look at me. Look at this belly. Oh, I was a skinny at one time. I was able to fit in my skinny jeans, but now, look at this stomach. Tigers were sure Poe would never defeat Tai Lu. She snuck out of the blunk house that night to do the job herself. The others chased after her. Don't try to stop me, she warned them. We're not trying to stop you, Viper said. We're coming with you. So Viper and Crane and Monkey and Tiger, Tiger went out to go get Tai Ling. The Fierce Five found Tai Ling on a rope bridge spanning a vast gorge. The Five began their attack. They fought bravely, just as Shifu had taught them. But the Snow Leopard's strong muscles backed up his Kung Fu kicks as he overpowered the group, finally using his special Kung Fu nerve attack that froze them in place. Tai Lung snarled as he bounded away to the valley. Oh no, they froze everyone. What they're going to do? Back at the palace, Shifu found Poe eating everything he could get his paws on. Hey, this is good. This is yummy. Oh, you got to really try these, these little honey snacks. Mmm, and the jelly snacks. And oh, you guys have delicious dessert here. And these soups are just delectable. Hey, stop the funny business. I need you to know that you need to start practicing. I need you to activate. Here, use this. And he used stir-frying dumplings to build refined Poe skills. It worked. Poe got better and better. Poe was excited. His kung fu dreams were coming true at last. Maybe he was worthy of being a warrior. The five returned, dejected, and told Shifu of their defeat to Tai Lung. Shifu decided that Poe needed to meet his destiny head on. He needed the dragon scroll. Read it, Poe, and fulfill your destiny, he said. Oh, let's see. Read it and return. Become a dragon warrior. Poe unrolled the scroll and gasped. It's blink! And all his new confidence seeped away. Tai Lung had already defeated the five. How was a chubby noodle slurping panda 
ever supposed to beat him. Even Shifu didn't understand. Well, the squall's blank and I don't understand. And I need some more pasta because I just love noodles. Oh my gosh. When Shifu ordered an evac evacuation of the valley, Poe went straight to his father father's noodle shop. His father quickly re realized that Poe needed some encouragement. And so he finally revealed the secret ingredient in his special noodle soup. There is no secret ingredient, he told Paul. To make something special, you have to believe it's special. What? Uh, what? There is no secret ingredient? Whoa. He unrolled the blank scroll again and saw his reflection in this shiny surface. It all made sense. There was no secret of the scroll. Now Paul understood what he had to do. I need to believe in myself. I'm special. And doesn't matter what shape I am or what I look like, I can do this. When Tai Long arrived at the palace, Shafu was waiting for him. I have come home, Master, Tai Lung said. This is no longer your home, Shafu replied, and I am no longer your master. They began a fierce fight. Bop, bop, bip, bip. I bip and I bop and I kick you with my foot and my leg and my Kong crew chop and a Kung Fu chop to you and a karate chop and a chop. Kung Fu master chop. Oh, bit, bit. Pao burst in the palace just as Tai Long was about to make a final deadly move on Shifu. At last, Tai Long couldn't believe it. This chubby panda was the dragon warrior? What are you going to do, big guy? He taunted. Sit on me? <laughs> you gonna bake me? You gonna... Do you gonna play patty cake? Uh -huh. But Poe didn't use the same kung fu moves as the others. He had his own panda style. The battle raged down the palace steps and through the village when Panda bounced the bad guy off his big belly. When the dust settled, Poe jumped up and snatched Tai Long's finger. Not the waxy finger hold, yelled Tai Long. The panda flexed his pinky and it was all over. The dragon war had won. Tears rang all over from every direction and as Poe marched victoriously through the valley. Shifu could hardly believe it. It is a odd way foretold, he said. You are the dragon warrior. Thank you, Poe. The five bowed with respect. Poe couldn't stop smiling. It was the greatest thing that everyone finally believed that truly the dragon warrior, but was even better believing in himself. Oh, this is so great. This is a special day. Oh, I did it. You just got to believe that you're special. The end.